Okay, now that we've exported all of our layers in, or images, um, in the build folder we have the image folder and the JSON folder. So on my personal uh, hard drive, I in my art folders where I'm uh, creating this project, I created another folder called Biohackers Data, and I'm going to select these folders and copy them and paste them into my personal hard drive just in case something ever happens to this folder uh, or this build let's say I mess up and I throw off the metadata um, I would be very upset so I want to make a backup of that and I suggest you do it too all our metadata and JSON file folders are there okay so the next thing we're going to do is we're going to go to pinata.cloud which is where we're going to host our images and our metadata so the deal with this is all right now this is where i block headed it up and my buddy mike would, would we had a good laugh over it and a cigarette this is this is where i made a mistake in my last collection so you can use this for free and it's one gigabyte of storage and which is fine if you're doing maybe a small collection or a pixel collection but if you're doing a 10,000 collection even a 1,000 collection I would highly suggest this it's not even a thing this is what you have to do you have to buy this plan 15 cents a m per gig a month that's nothing people will rub a nickels together so don't be like me. Don't be a blockhead and go with the free plan. Sign up for your plan because if you exceed this, some of the files on your metadata or some of the images, they won't, it, as soon as it hits one gig, it will stop. Okay? So I went ahead and signed up for this. 15 cents, what is the big deal? Now that you are signed up, go ahead and uh, go, it'll go, pull up into your dashboard like this. Here I have the zombie bitsins, okay? This is where I gummed it up last time because I uploaded the zombie bitsins images and it was already 1.3. And it had a delay time, it didn't show me this stuff. So I thought I was under a gig, it was fine. No, that was incorrect. I had to go through and delete this. These CID numbers are very important and if any of this is missing, man, you're gonna be having a terrible time and just be failing Blockhead University. So. Listen to your teacher and learn, you know, smart people learn from their mistakes, wise people learn from others. So learn from my mistakes and be a wise person and don't gum that up like a blockhead because you want to be cheap. 15 cents a gig is fine. So once you navigate through all this, go ahead and we're going to now upload our biohacker images. So I'm going to go upload folder select my folder in my biohackers and remember we created a new folder called biohackers data where we copied and pasted the image folder and the JSON folder from our build folder so go ahead and select images let's go ahead and make sure that this is correct I know it is so we'll go ahead and upload that and I want to upload all 500 images and we're gonna call this bio Hackers images. It's nice and simple. Upload. And this may take some time, so we'll let this run. <clears throat> okay, now that we have our biohackers uploaded, we have a unique CID number. And if we go into our images, click in the little eye icon it should load our 500 biohackers. So if we select the first one, we know that's her, purple, perfect. And as you can see here, we have the gateway URL that's pointing towards this image. Everything looks good. You need to copy the CID of the, of the images in Pinata. Then we're going to come back to our config file this is the correct one so 
ends with SHSA. This is correct. So save that. So you want to put the image CID right here and then come back down and do node utils slash update underscore info dot js. So we're going to make sure we save that, run this, and now all of our build should have the correct JSON SHSA. All right, so now that all of our data has, metadata has been updated correctly, now we're going to upload and we're going to open the biohackers data JSON folder and upload that. Upload. Now we have the correct metadata CID 